Hello, this is Bob at Autobahn Power. We just received this 18G Mitsubishi turbocharger in. It's for a WRX. It was overnight FedEx. They uh, were a little rough with it. Obviously played catch, turbocharger lost. They ruined the indexing on the unit. I wanted to give you this quick tip in case it ever happens to anyone. The uh, spinning the impeller, we had a slight touching of the steel impeller to the outside aluminum housing. So we flipped the unit over. You'll find indexing marks on the back. See, these are aligned right now. They were off about a quarter of an inch. So remove the uh, wastegate actuator rod, remove this steel circlip, and then we tapped the housing around so our index is aligned, flipped it over, checked the armature, and it was much better, but we still, with slight pressure to the side, had touching of the uh, impeller to the housing. So next, we removed the clip again, pulled off this aluminum housing. We inspected the land where the uh, O-ring is. There's a very firm O-ring. Everything looked really good inside. There wasn't any damage to anything internally. So we took our dead blow, noted where on the housing the impeller was hitting, and we clearanced it. We tapped it over. Now, the, the O-ring is firm, so, and we're talking very tight tolerances. You need to be careful of what you're doing. Do it slowly. So we were able to get where we had with slight pressure, no interference. We flipped it over, made sure our indexing was still correct, inserted the steel retaining clip. Then you take your dead blow, uh, a slim punch or a flat blade, and you have to go all the way around this and tap it in. Your uh, lines wouldn't, weren't on when we did this. So if you don't seat that clip, the turbo is going to loosen up eventually and it's going to take itself out. Put the actuator rod back up, flip it over, slight pressure to the side in all directions, make sure there's no interference. We lucked out. One quick note on these when you're checking your bearing tolerances, people tend to grab the end of the shafts and wobble them. You've got two bearings here, one in each housing. When you do that, you're amplifying your clearances, so don't do it that way. Grab each end and pull them and push them towards you and away. You should feel virtually nothing. Thank you, hopefully you'll never need this tip. Autobahn Power, out.